lahat ng bagay ngayon ay tungkol sa AI, no? And for sure, narinig ko at nakita mo na rin ito. Kung hindi pa, panoorin mo tong video na to. Kamusta? Tati here from Expert Zone Southeast Asia team working with Microsoft. And sa video na to, mag-uusapan natin ng Copilot on Windows 11. So, bakit ko pilot? Bakit hindi? Well, kung hanggang ngayon, eh, hindi mo pa rin alam kung para saan ito, medyo late ka na. Imagine mo na lang na meron kang sariling assistant na pwedeng sumagot sa mga tanong mo anytime of the day. Microsoft Copilot is your intelligent AI companion that can help share the mental load. You can efficiently complete specific tasks na minsan ay hindi natin natatapos dahil distracted tayo. It helps you save time and focus on the things that matters more. Sobrang easy lang i-access ng Copilot. Click mo lang yung Copilot icon na may dito sa taskbar or by simply using the keyboard shortcut na Windows plus C. Take note of your Windows version kasi nakadepende ito kung saan mo makikita yung Copilot. Pwede nasa tabi ng search bar or nasa right corner ng taskbar. So before, if you open Copilot, meron ka makikita na conversation style like creative, balanced, and precise. Importante ito kasi yung response ni Copilot will depends kung ano yung conversation style na gamit mo. But now with the recent update, wala na ito. Alam mo bang merong 6 types of prompts na pwede mong gamitin para may utilize ng Copilot? Isa-isahin natin ng Learn, Edit, Transform, Summarize, Create, and Catch Up. For example, meron kang gustong malaman ng topic. Just ask Copilot, kagaya ng what's the current stock market price of the Philippines today? Isa mong gusto ko with Copilot is meron siyang follow-up prompt na pwedeng i-click ka agad para sa mga follow-up questions mo. You can ask Copilot to proofread for you. Can you check this paragraph for grammar or any inconsistencies? Pangatlo, transform. Copilot can turn a piece of information into something more digestible. Kagaya ng pag-check ng mga upcoming flights from Philippines to Bangkok and back in a table for a November 17 trip. Next, create. Easy lang maging creative with Copilot. Kagaya ng paggawa ko ng image, Asking about ingredients being added to a cake. It's a birthday cake for a 16-year-old celebration based on Xbox Halo 3D animated style made in Unreal Engine 5. And of course, catch up. Kung meron kang na-miss na gustong balikan, well, Copilot can help you with that. I asked Copilot to give me a summary of today's news and headlines in the Philippines and you can also include to highlight the weather situation on certain area. Ngayon alam mo lang kung paano paggamit ang prompt. Importante rin malaman na hindi laging tama or precise ang output ng Copilot, lalo na kung kulang ang prompt mo. Dito na papasok ang Advanced Prompt. So ano ang Advanced Prompt? Ang Advanced Prompt ay ang mas kompleto at detalyado prompt. Para mas madaling ma-process ng Copilot ang task na pinapagawa mo. Alam mo ba na mayroong four key elements ang Advanced Prompt? Una na dyan ang goal. What response do you want from Copilot? So ano yung mismong goal mo? Second, context. Why do you need it and what it is for? Para saan ba yun? Pangatlo, source. What information or samples should Copilot use? Saan siya kukuha? And last, expectation. Is there any key information you can give so Copilot meets your expectation? So kailangan mas detalyado. As long as you have these key elements in mind, expect Copilot to give you answers created for you. Kung nagustuhan mo itong video na to, make sure to give it a like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Well, that's it for me. Kita kita sa next video.